Today is International Holocaust Remembrance Day, and it also marks 75 years since the liberation of the Auschwitz death camp. A local rabbi lost many family members during the Holocaust. He spoke with 10 on your side's Elena Baloris about what today means for him, Elena. Well, Laura Stephanie, Rabbi Israel Zoberman says today is a day of remembrance and reflection. He lost many family members during World War II, and he's on a mission to build bridges of peace between people. But to do that, he also has to educate them about the realities and atrocities of the Holocaust. It's a somber day for Rabbi Israel Zoberman, the anniversary of the liberation of Auschwitz, a concentration camp where more than one million people were murdered. So uh, there's that great sense of relief that finally the war was won by the Allied forces, but we have remembered that it came at such a heavy cost to the Jewish people. His father was spared from the camp, but drafted into the Red Army, a Soviet force that helped liberate the concentration camp 75 years ago on this day. This is my father in Russian uniform, look at this young Jewish boy. He didn't realize what he would witness. Zoberman was born soon after the war ended. The family moved about, living in displaced person camps until they settled in Israel and then the United States. Memories of the family members they lost are painful for Zoberman. We cannot let go of the pain that memory can bring to us, mm -hmm. but we know that unless we carry the pain with us, joy will not come. He believes it's his duty, his mission from God, to educate people about the horrors of the Holocaust. We who were in the DP camps, the space person camps, we are now called upon to serve as witnesses. And he fears people don't really know what happened. The Holocaust did not happen 4,000 years ago, it just happened 70 some years ago. And for the sake of the present and the future, we have to continue to teach and educate. Six million Jewish people, including one million and a half children, died during the Holocaust. I'm Marielena Boloris, 10 on your side.